We build robotic training tools to help teams train more safely and more effectively. MVP was born out of a collaboration between engineering student athletes at Dartmouth and the Dartmouth football program. Head coach Buddy Tevens had cut tackling out of his practices entirely in order to protect his players from injury, but that left him with no way to effectively train live, so he brought this challenge to us at the engineering school. As engineering student athletes, we understood both sides of the problem. We needed something that was going to be mobile, uh, represent the motion of a human player, but also withstand all of the trials and tribulations that a football coach would put it through. As an athlete, you needed something that mimicked the motion of a high-performance athlete, but was soft and padded and safe enough to actually tackle. So we invented a mobile tackling dummy, something that runs around the field at the speed and agility of a NFL player and allows you to safely tackle it, safely bring it to the ground, eliminating player-on-player -player contact in practice and creating a safer opportunity to train the skills that you need to effectively perform on Saturday. We put all of our robots through extensive field testing. In the early days, we were on the field twice a day during two days during preseason. We would break all of the weakest components, really abuse the hell out of it, try and flesh out all of the weak points in the system and repair those through a combination of empirical testing and FEA. We were able to actually hone down on a design that is robust enough to withstand the daily abuses that it faces on the field with football players year round. We were out on the field with the LA Rams. We actually had serial units number one and two out on the field training with the, the Rams during their preseason camp and some Navy SEALs came up from the nearby base in Coronado and they said, hey, this thing's awesome, can we shoot at it? After we'd heard that a few times, we started developing along that pathway. We actually executed a development contract with the Air Force to take our tackling dummy technology and transition that to a dual purpose technology where we build a live fire training target that moves in the same way to provide the realism that our tackling dummies do, but for our armed forces. So we've taken that highly mobile drive base, we've up armored it to essentially create a little electric tank and we've developed a target technology that actually senses when and where bullets pass through so you can provide live real-time feedback to the operators and actually elicit a physical response where the dummy falls over based on a pre-programmed number of hits in, in the selected locations. Once we've created a highly mobile drive base that can operate in such harsh environments, we're finding all sorts of new uses. Not only are these good for football training, but for a wide range of sports where you need to eliminate player-on-player -player contact or give a coach greater control over the training environment. On the military side, once we've built a highly mobile armored platform, we're finding uses for that beyond just a shooting target. We're looking at it as a means to evacuate injured personnel from the battlefield, a way to perform last mile delivery in hostile environments that are too dangerous for our, our people to be in, but you still need something that can move with the speed and agility that a human exhibits.